Good news for the Samsung lovers. The Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 shatters records with AM22 score surpassing 1.7 million. As we already know that Samsung gonna use this chipset or an advanced version for its upcoming Galaxy S24 lineup. And now this news might be a good relief for all the Galaxy lovers. Recently, Qualcomm revealed that the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 will be announced on October 24 at Snapdragon Summit. So the new SoC is still months away from now. But we have had multiple reports about the development of the chipset, and most of them came from credible sources. One of the main highlights from those is that Qualcomm is testing two different versions of the chipset. Among these, the one that is exceptionally efficient will end up in commercial devices. But the real question is, how much of a performance upgrade will the 8 Gen 3 offer? According to a leaked report from a reliable source, the highly anticipated Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 and 22 test scores have been revealed. These scores have amazed everyone, reaching an astonishing 1.7 million. It's important to note that these scores come from an early-stage development model, so they may not accurately represent the final performance of mass-produced devices. However, they provide an exciting glimpse into the immense potential of Qualcomm's upcoming flagship chip. Snapdragon aims to revolutionize the mobile processing industry and compete directly with industry giants like Apple. Apple's A16 chip is a formidable competitor. While the 8 Gen 3 falls slightly behind the A16 and Geekbench 6 scores, achieving 2,500 points in the single-core test and 6,200 points in the multi-core test, it still remains highly competitive. Moreover, it represents a significant improvement over its predecessor, the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2, which scored 2,000 points in the single-core test and 5,500 points in the multi-core test on Geekbench 6. These preliminary results indicate that the 8 Gen 3 is a powerful contender even at this early stage. Its improved power efficiency could be the result of Qualcomm just utilizing one Cortex-X4 core. Recently, ICE Universe created a fair difference between the 8 Gen 3 and its upcoming rival MediaTek Dimensity 9300. As per the tweet, Dimensity 9300 will gain the upper hand against its eventual rival in multi-core CPU performance, but it will struggle in power efficiency. While 8 Gen 3's NPU will deliver 60 teraflops of performance, but does not divulge how the Dimensity 9300 would fare, he also states that the image signal processor of Qualcomm's upcoming flagship release will see an improvement. As you might have guessed, this kind of information is slightly ambiguous and a ton of information has yet to be revealed concerning the two smartphone chipsets. Fortunately, since they will presumably be getting announced in October, we will know their specifications and differences much sooner. Various reports have suggested that the Xiaomi 14 will be the first phone to launch with Snapdragon 8 Gen 3. Regarding the Galaxy S24 series, the rumor is that Samsung is bringing back Exynos chips to the lineup. So some countries will get the 8 Gen 3 variants of Galaxy S24, while others will get the Exynos 2400 variants. How the Exynos 2400 compares to the 8 Gen 3 remains to be seen. So how do you like these new M2 scores of upcoming Snapdragon 8 Gen 3? Share your valuable thought below in the comment section. And if you guys enjoyed the video, then a sub to the channel will be massive, and I'll see you guys in the next one. See you for the next time. Peace out.